See it before you breathe it. Wildfire smoke continues to blanket our area, and the longer it sticks around, the worse it is for lungs. Doctors say this could cause respiratory problems for people for months down the line. Well, let's switch to our Trevor Alt, who joins us live with the very latest, and it has been so bad out there, Trevor. It really has, and it seems like it just won't go away, Jennifer. Right now, the air quality is considered unhealthy, unhealthy for sensitive groups, which by itself is a problem for huge groups of people. But the problem is, on top of that, even if you are healthy, you could experience some respiratory problems because this smoke just won't go away. Yeah, no, that's what it's been. They're like, oh, it's so smoky, it's so hazy. Natalie Fremer is in Portland for the first time visiting her cousin Kara. I find it like I can tell the difference. Like, I, I, it's harder to breathe. Kara says she's balancing being a good host with being a good parent. She wants her four kids to get outside, but with smoke permeating the air, she has to keep it to a minimum. It's the last week of summer, and and the kids are going back to school next week, and we really wanted to, to, to go big. Sure. Ben said we're going home. Health officials say that's the right call. Dr. Andy Barnett of Legacy Go Health Urgent Care says they're already seeing patients with respiratory complaints. The air quality has gotten even worse in the Portland metro area than it was a week ago. We're seeing levels uh, as high as it's been in the last several years. And the fact the smoke has stuck around so long is only making it worse. With every breath, you're taking in more particles, just as if you were inhaling anything else that was harmful. Breathing in smoke from cigarettes and breathing and smoke from forest fires is going to affect your lungs in much the same way. A group of scientists called Berkeley Earth measured what air pollution does to the lungs, and according to their calculations, right now in Portland, just breathing this air for a day is the equivalent of smoking five cigarettes. Now, Dr. Barnett, who I talked to, says this is exactly why, even after this smoke clears, it's possible we'll see people with respiratory problems many months down the line. Reporting live in North Portland, Trevor Alt, Coin Six News. Mm, five cigarettes. Wow. Thanks, Trevor.